What about us? This is battery's junk, so I'm just gonna throw it away. Boom! What up, what up, it's your boy MD. Hey Barras, it's good to mess. What's up, Barras? How are you, Barras, doing the Baron Nation? So today is Wednesday. And I've got some interesting news. But before I get to that, yesterday is Tuesday and it was good to be back in the gear again, getting in those hours, getting in those reps being the best I can be, um, punch block, roundhouse, kick to the leg, but we also did some moving drills, and after that, the little kids wanted to play sprawl ball, so played with them with Roddick, um, I was teamed up with a, uh, um, Peter Parker's brother, aka Spider-Man, and he got knocked out within two seconds, so I was left to fend for myself with three people throwing balls at me. And I actually did pretty good. Um, yeah, I did pretty good. The only reason why I lost is that I forgot to sprawl on the ball, so I kicked it, and then I picked up another ball and threw it. And you're supposed to sprawl in every ball, even if you get a kick it, so yeah, that was sort of a mistake. Anyways, next session, next lesson, everybody who was in the first class stayed for the next class. So, yeah, I found that interesting, so, yeah, I mean, yeah. And then at the end, of, but at the end of the first session, everyone in class, except me, got promoted, since I just got promoted, to a yellow belt, two straps, it's quite cool to see the promotion process again. Um, what's his face? Roddick was pretty excited, because he told me he had been a yellow belt one strike for a very long time. Next session, just a well, yeah, just adult, but my my Barra Jack came over, so I did the move with them, and we did the somebody walks up to you behind the back, grabs your neck, trying to choke your boy out, grab his arm, his forearm before he can actually choke you, squat down and lift him up. That's one of my favorite takedowns. Except when you are the one being taken down. Anyways, today, Wednesday, just before I left home, I got an email. And the Barra that wanted to play around with me in Texas. And it was going to send a plane ticket. First, uh, said it would be it would work out better in February. So we postponed it to February and in a different location. So, I actually wanted to go... I actually wanted, I mean, yeah. Now I'm still gonna go to, I'm still going to golf and ski now. I'm just gonna go, instead of every day to golf and ski, I'm just gonna go three days a week. Pretty good, pretty good. You gotta be careful when you do that so you don't break your eye. Drink some tea. Where did the <laughs> what a virus? I just went out of golf and ski, and I'm actually my club's a little better. I'm getting some more compression in there, which is good. But what's weird is that it, I know it looks good in the range, but when I actually go and play now next spring, I hope it's I don't know what's gonna look like. No, I mean, it's all about consistency and stuff. Oh, yeah, the one thing I didn't tell you, though, is yesterday there was somebody there. You know how when you walk into the, if you go to the store and you walk in the 
dishwasher aisle how you call it breeze because it's just sm it's not like it smells bad it's not like it smells good you just can't breathe well somebody must have had the deodorant while, while i was drilling last night because it was like the freak well hey two nights ago two nights ago whoa okay almost got hit by a bloody car all right, you're at the G. Let's do some work up in here. Stove this. I here to put in hours, hours, my dude, hours. None of this. Hello. Pretty good.